Hi, I'm Adam Shostak, and this is the second of a series of videos I'm making to address questions people have about what's it like to receive threat modeling training in this new distributed world. And this, this really addresses something that Grant said, and Grant said, I can't imagine what it's like to take training. I'm thinking of standing at whiteboards. And you know, that's what I think of as well. This was my training class at Black Hat in 2019. And this is the way a lot of people conceive of threat modeling training. And when we move to the distributed model, there's a number of changes that happen. We have, and I'm going to walk you through each of these, but we have exercise books. We do the exercises with pen and paper. There's an answers video. We get together, we discuss what we learned, and we reflect on it. The exercise books often will use a bike as a service as the core exercise for what are we working on. And so people will walk through the question of what we're working on with bikes as a service. There's an answers video in which I show you my own answers to this question. You do the pen and paper work, you can watch the answers video on your own. And then we get together in class. And for privacy reasons, I'm not going to show you the Brady Bunch view of that. And then when we get together and talk about the work that we've done, we observe what other people have done, giving us a chance to look at the differences. We reflect what might we do differently. And of course, there's a few hidden Star Wars jokes. 